Hello everyone and welcome back to Kevin on Caffeine. My name is Isaac and we're back playing some Agrarian Skies for episode 17. And today, I think we're going to end up going to the Nether. So, last episode, we started on the Nether portal. Uh, we're almost there. We were two pieces of obsidian off. And as you can see, I have two pieces left. Oh my gosh, what a coincidence. And uh, also, I've heard it's going to be pretty dangerous in there. So, I'm, I'm kind of a little bit scared of what we're going to find. So, uh, what I've done in preparation is I used a little bit extra obsidian we had. And I've made myself a blood sword. So, now we've got ourselves a nice sword. Uh, made of mostly obsidian, a little bit of stick in there as well. So it's got reinforced three, uh, plus seven attack. It's quite a powerful sword, I think. So let's just try it on a cow. Look at that, one hit killed a cow. So I think this thing's pretty good. Let's see, can it? Uh, cows have only got like a few hearts, so it's not. Uh, I don't know. It's pretty. I, I'm happy with it. I'm happy with it. I think it'll be okay for now. And, uh, and considering that we can't really use the, we can't really use obsidian for much else, and we don't really have any of the materials we can use to make swords at the moment. Uh, we could use our iron and stuff, but then we need to make a fawn smeltery. And we kind of want to go to the nether now, so that's fine. Okay, so flint and steel. Get to the flint and steel, and boom. There we go. Now, I'm not going to take everything with me. I kind of don't want to take the quest book with me, just because um, I don't know if we can get new ones back if we lose it. Uh, no real need to take the stone axe, I don't think. Um, I could probably keep my axe of despair, just in case we see any like cool nether trees. Uh, get rid of this stuff. Uh, you can go, you can go. Let's open these. Someone had to go at me in the comments. I forgot to open these. Let's have a go. Let's have a look. Kaplunk. Kaplunk. Oh my god. Oh my Jesus. Look at this. We got a coconut saplings, starfruit saplings, apple saplings, peach saplings, olive saplings. Oh my god. Spaghetti and meatballs. Oh yeah. Let's have some of this just before we go. Let's sit at the table. Oh nom 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 nom. Oh my god. That was great. Look at that. We've got like three and a half minutes of well fed. That is amazing. Okay. So when we get back. Uh, I think what I might do is, I'll probably do what I ended, like, said I was going to do like a million episodes ago. Uh, I was thinking about making a tree farm over here, but what I think I might actually do is set up a tree farm over there. Like, make another platform coming off that platform and set up a huge tree farm over that way. So, I think what I'm going to do is set up, like, my factory over this way. Because, uh, as we figured out last episode as well, this stuff here is uh, it's not working anymore. We've got a bunch of iron in here. We've got almost 40 broken iron. Um, in here, which is not getting smelted down for some reason in the crucible, and we're not getting any more iron over here. So, I think I might have to uh, come up with a new system and set that up in a nice little factory over there because this is uh, a bit of an eyesore. I'll just all sort of sitting here or out in the open like this, make it look a bit neater and put it all over there. Anyway, off we go to the nether. Let's just get rid of these real quick so it looks somewhat nice. We might move this nether portal at some point if we get enough diamonds to make a pick. I mean, I think we've got like what six? Yeah, we've got six diamonds already, so we do already have enough, but uh, I mean, if we've got like that many spare. Okay, here we go. Oh my god, look at that. The shaders are making it all weird. <laughs> oh, I don't think I've ever seen the nether with shaders on. don't know how it's going to look. There's no sun, so maybe it won't look great. I'm actually pretty scared now, actually. I'm... God, I don't know what's going to be here. Oh, it's... Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, it's, it's dark. It's very, very, very dark. Oh, really? Ah! Okay, the... Oh, I didn't bring the... Ah, I didn't bring the flipping thing, did I? Ah, well, this will be fun. <laughs> I didn't bring the um, pickaxe, so I have no pick. Uh, let's just put some fire out and try and get that quartz, because we can at least get what we can. Uh, oh, as if I didn't bring the pickaxe, what is that about? Okay, um, I think the only way we're really going to get back is... Oh, I should have put nether walls on. Uh, I think the only way, the way we're gonna get back is if a gas lights out. I think is the way uh, is the way you do that. Do I have the I have the flint and steel? Will this work? Can I like get it to spark? If I like put nether rack down, is that gonna? <laughs> I don't think it works, but it might do. Uh, and I can mm, do nothing but try. Um, maybe, possibly. Oh, I've got my I've got a flint and steel still. Like, what are you what are you playing at? <laughs> I thought I was lost there. What is that about? Okay, I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna get the pickaxe. I need my pickaxe. Without a pickaxe, it's pretty much useless. I'm also going to get a bunch of torches as well, because that was really dark. Okay, so the pickaxe is... where now? Here we go. We'll take pick of misfortune. Why misfortune? I've no idea what Thormic does. Uh, I don't know what that does, so I'll just hope it does something good. Let's take a bunch of you, and let's make ourselves some torches. So, uh, sticks and torches. There we go. 48 should be more than enough. It was a bit of a waste of coal. Like, well, I don't know. We, we're getting a lot of coal, actually. We've got quite a bit nowadays. So I don't think it was that big of a waste. Oh, my gosh. It looks really weird when you go in the middle of this thing with shaders on. Okay, here we go again. Take two. Let's light this place up. It actually looks quite nice, actually. It's scary, but it looks pretty nice in the dark. Um, <laughs> it, it adds a, an atmosphere 
when you can't see past like a few meters in front of you. Okay, this is oh, sulfur. I'm not, I don't really need sulfur. I kind of want like gold and stuff. So I'll take this stuff because I know this doesn't blow up. Um, I'm like, oh my god, what is this? Mining level stone. Oh my god, what can I mine with this then? Can I mine anything? This is very dark. I apologize. I'll try and brighten it up in like post, but this is uh, this is very dark. Very, very dark. Okay. Um, we've got some nether diamond ore, but we can't mine it because we've got no flipping... We ain't got a diamond pick, a pick good enough to mine it. Ah! Um, okay, okay, forget this. I'm gonna make an iron pick. <laughs> okay. We've got, we've got enough iron back at the base. There's no point using this guy if you can't mine out. So, third time's the charm. Let's grab some iron from in here. One, two, three. And let's make ourselves an iron pick. Now, let me just check we didn't make one before. Uh, I don't think we did, but I might be wrong. No, I don't think we did. Okay. Uh, sticks and iron. Iron pick. So, we've got to be careful because the, um, the, the ores in the nether actually explode sometimes. Which is not the greatest, I must say. Um, like, the, the nether diamond ore will mine it and there's a chance that it will actually uh, explode. I'm sure, I'll, look at that chest reflecting everything. Okay, so let's hope that this guy does not explode. Can we... Please? Please? Oh. It's doing something, but that looks like it's not gonna work. What is that about? Can we mine this stuff? Really? Redstone. Do we need a shovel for this? These are just normal ores, aren't they? I'm pretty sure. I thought. Maybe. It looks like something might be going on there. I can't see anything. I'll oh, forget this. I'm going to just get the quads. Really? Oh, I bet it's a, I bet it's a config change. I bet they've made it so that flipping... Oh, I bet it's some sort of weird um, thing just with the map in general that we can't mine these ores in the nether because normally... You can mine quartz with an iron pickaxe. I am almost 100% positive. Now, I'm not sure. They must be able to mine them. Otherwise, they just wouldn't have bothered putting the mod in, I assume. But, hmm. Let's see. Oh, Jesus. Wow. Okay, well. Um, okay, well, that could work. We did get some. It took a long time. It, I think it's a definite explosion, maybe. We got some stuff. We got um, some more quartz, which is nice. Uh, there's another coal there. I'm not really gonna bother myself too much about coal. Let's go and oh god, let's go and try not dying. <laughs> let's go. Let's go have a look around. There's some soup. There's some soup. There's some uh, mushrooms over there. I can see a tree uh, over in the distance. Uh, to be honest, actually, we could probably just like walk around lighting this stuff up, couldn't we? I mean, it's pretty dangerous, but it uh, saves torches. Yeah, there's some shrooms over here. Let's take these guys. This would be a nice source of lava. So instead of waiting for the um, the thingamajig, the, uh, the crucible we've got at the minute, we could actually just come over here and uh, fill this guy up. Do we have tesseracts? Yeah, we do. We've got thermal expansion, don't we? So what we should probably look into is actually completing that but that uh, quest in the quest book that said about tesseracts. Um, I think that over there is something to do with blood magic, maybe? Do we have blood magic? Maybe? Might be talking lies. Oh, no, we do. Yep. I think that's like a big, like, pillow of blood with, like, in the middle, like, liquid blood, which is, uh, okay, I guess. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, I think what we should do is uh, set up some sort of pump. Uh, oh, we don't have build craft, do we? Pump? <laughs> <laughs> Although we do have the endothermic pump from uh, X Utility, which I'm pretty sure it does the same thing, but just replaces the uh, lava with cobblestone as it's going, which I think is actually like less um, laggy than the other stuff, so that might be a good idea anyway. Uh, oh god, oh god, that's the very dark pit. Well. We've spent all this time trying to get here, and to be honest, so far, I'm not really digging it. We've not managed to get any ores because it's some weird thing where we can't mine anything. Um, can we get these? Oh, we can get the, the blue mushrooms. What can we use these for? Can we eat these? Uses. Uh, yeah, we can make glow shroom stew. Why not? Why not? Oh my god, it's... Is everything on blue? I... I... I, think, I feel like I've got a bluish tinge to my screen, but that might just be me making stuff up. <laughs> I have no idea. Okay, let's just light this place up a bit more. Uh, anything? Anything at all? It's very, very dark. Uh, we should have probably actually put a waypoint down at the portal, which I'm going to go do now, because the last thing I want is to get lost down here. Uh, that would not be great. Let's go find the portal. At least... Oh, I know, mining gravel with an iron pickaxe while I'm playing that. Uh, at least the gravel. At least the flipping... Um, this stuff breaks. There they're back. 
Got a little bit of nether quartz. Don't really know what we're gonna use it for, but we've got some. Um, I cannot see a thing. And I just know it's gonna be like a billion times worse when I put it up on YouTube, so my my apologies, right. Um, how the heck am I supposed to get out of here? Up here, maybe? I cannot see a thing. All right, here we go. Light this up. Surprised I haven't seen any mobs so far, actually. That's, um, that's one thing that surprised me. I thought there would have been quite a few mobs about. Uh, I mean, to be honest, we haven't seen any, um, any zombie pigmen yet, either. Uh, some saltpeter, some copper, some coal. Let me just try this again. Let me see. I know it's going to... Ooh. Oh. I can mine the coal. And I can mine the copper. Hmm. There might have been some sort of spawn protection, maybe. <laughs> Around when we spawned. Or maybe I just... Hmm. That seems pretty odd, actually. So we can mine stuff, then, I guess? It lets me mine some things, but not others. Let's try this stuff down here. Whatever. What's this? Right, redstone. Can we mine this? Okay, maybe we just can't mine some stuff. Or is this going to blow up when I mine it? Hmm. Or maybe I just need a better pick. Maybe like a diamond pick for this stuff. If you do know, please tell me in the comment section because I have not a clue. And uh, it's probably going to take me a while to figure it out. So your help would be appreciated. Let's see. I know it's going to try and blow up on me, but hopefully we get some redstone out of it, maybe. Possibly. Oh, okay. Never mind. Maybe I just can't break redstone then. Maybe redstone's just one of those blocks you just can't break. Silver? Apparently we can get silver. That's fine. Silver's good. Get some silver. Now the cool thing is, I think these actually give more odds than normal stuff. Yeah, look at this. One of these gives us four silver, pulled by silver, which we can then smelt down into four silver uh, ingots, which is pretty cool. So we got four coal from each of those, four copper, etc, etc. Which is pretty ridiculous. I think the same is even true for the diamonds. I think if you like pulverize the diamond door, we get like a bunch of diamonds and the redstone one as well. You get like a bunch of redstone from it. I uh, will take the lead. So yeah, this is pretty cool. We've, uh, the first thought it wasn't going to be that great, but to be honest, it seems to be working out okay. For some reason, we cannot mine, um, what's it called? This stuff here, quartz. But for some reason, we can mine certain things, maybe? I'm not too sure. Now, like I said, I don't know if it's a config change just for this map specifically where you can't mine redstone with an iron pickaxe. Or if it's just like a, a general thing with Netherlord, maybe you need some like better stuff, possibly. Uh, we could go get that glowstone, but I don't think we're that in demand of glowstone, to be honest. We've got quite a bit of the stuff back at home. Uh, what's this? I have no idea, and I'm going to die of hunger. And this is the last place I ever want to die of hunger. Is that okay? Maybe? Probably thought a bit too much of our um, soup before we left. How is this? Uh, tin? I'll take some tin. Try not to die. See, we can't... What? 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 Why can't we mine tin? What is this about? I knew we could mine our die. I think we need um, an animate pick for that, but I'm, I'm confused. I am utterly baffled as to what we can mine, what we can't mine, what's allowed, what's not allowed. Oh my god, it's very dark, and my god, it is very, very dark. Okay, well, I'm going to head back, guys. This is, this is far too dark for a start. Uh, do we have any sort of, like, night vision goggles in this? Let's have a look. Just night vision possibly no we can make we can make a potion of night vision i guess uh what do we need for a potion of night vision a golden carrot and an awkward potion that's not too bad actually golden carrots probably not too hard to come by i think we've just got some carrots back at the base so that shouldn't be too bad and then uh an awkward potion is just like water and uh, another one uh so i'll take this because coal's always fun and we use like a bunch of coal getting all these torches so i'll take all these guys back uh hopefully none of this blows up on me but for every single one of these we get, we get four coal. So that's kind of worth it. Look at that 40 coal right there. 44, 48. Oh my god, we've got so much coal. So much coal. So I think what I might do is uh, possibly come back here when we need some more resources and stuff. Um, but to be honest, it's kind of dark and really, really scary. And um, um, what I'll probably do is just set up the uh, the factory that I was going to set up um, on the new platform back in the overworld. So let's have a look. Ooh, iron. Take that. And again, each one of these gives us four as well, I believe. So, yeah, look at that. Four dust. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Any more for any more? Uh, some gold. Can't mind the gold, of course. Uh, anything else so far before we head back? New. Uh, is this more iron? Yeah, we'll take all the iron because we need quite a bit of iron. So, what I think I might do is uh, next episode, probably start up on making some cyclic assemblers. And, like I say, probably start up on... Uh, setting up the fully automated ingot production 
because the method we got the money doesn't really work. I think between episodes, I'm probably going to try to set up that tree farm because you don't want to see me sit there just putting down blocks and then putting down saplings and then just waiting for it to go and stuff. So I'll probably do that between episodes. Uh, we've lit up this place kind of well. You can see a little bit now, which is okay, I guess. But uh, it's not the best. The good thing is we've got some cobalt right here, which is pretty cool. If we ever uh, want to get some Tinker's Construct uh, tools, some really good ones, we can come and grab that cobalt, which is pretty nice. I also know there's some iodite around as well. So we should never be in short supply of that stuff, which is pretty cool. So let's head on back. And I think that pretty much does it. How are you doing? You've got like two buckets worth. Did I put more in you? I didn't. Uh, I should get that back on producing cobblestone. And to be honest, I think we've got enough cobblestone to last us a lifetime. Look at this. I mean, we've got almost this chest. Well, that chest is full. This chest is almost full. Flipping out, we've got so much cobblestone. Uh, but it's nice. We can make platforms out of it. What I'll probably do in the future is just make platforms, like I did with this one, uh, make the bottom of the platform out of cobblestone, then make the top out of something that looks a little bit nicer. Just use uh, the cobblestone as like a, a base so we can get everything back, uh, which is pretty nice. Let's have a look. Uh, what else? What's the next quest? Uh, do, 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 do. Let's have a look. I know there was one about a tesseract. So there's this one, which is make a sifter. So we'll probably do that one. We've already done most of it, to be honest. Ender pearls we can get close to, we can get, and soul sand, I believe we get with the um, barrels, which is not too bad. Uh, dust, uh, iron gravel ore is, to be honest, like the easiest thing in the world to get. We can probably do that right now. Uh, do, 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 do. Let's take four of you. Do we just have to craft it or do we have to hand it in? Oh, no, we've done it. Okay, or sand. Oh, okay, so we got to get four um, iron sand stuff. Do we happen to have any lying about? Oh, we do as well. Look at that. Beautiful. There we go. Uh, although we couldn't just, we could just break it down, couldn't we? We can just do this. We can just go plunk, grab a hammer, break it, recreate it. There we go. Uh, any more quests? Nope, that's it. Okay, so let's pick this bag, claim reward, there we go, and then let's open this bag. What do we get? Ooh, we got a creepy doll. Now, I'm pretty sure, ooh, from Ex Nihilo, I've no idea what we use this for. Oh, we got an angry doll as well, oh gosh. We got an angry and a creepy doll and a quarter of a heart. Let's just use it. Oh, apparently we can't use it. <laughs> okay, never mind, we'll just put that back in there. Let's eat our other spaghetti and meatballs. We deserve it, we've been to Nether, it was pretty scary. Don't know if we're going to be going back too soon, and oh my god. We've got so much to do. We've still got to set up this whole... I want to get this, like, as an actual automated mob farm. Uh, I think I might move this up into the sky so that they fall to the death. Uh, maybe if we want to just collect stuff. Or I might make it so they fall and then they're just barely alive so we can finish them off. Uh, my sword... Oh, God. Why did that guy blow up? My sword didn't really get to see that much action. But to be honest, I guess we can... Oh, God. Oh, it's actually that good. It's actually pretty good. Come on, fight me. Fight me. What? Oh, Jesus. Okay. Don't fight me. <laughs> oh, it's, oh, I like it. I like it. Look at this. Look at this guy. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. Look at that. Oh, I begin to feel comfortable with this thing. Yeah, what? 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 Oh, I like it. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we'll definitely... Oh, look, we've got... What did we get? Comfortable. we got sharpness. Oh, yeah. Look at that. It's got like an iron band around it. That's pretty cool. So, uh, yeah. A few episodes from now, probably. Maybe. Maybe next 10 episodes, possibly. Next 20, next 100. Uh, we should set up a mob like spawning platform farm thing over there. Machine factory coming over that side. Tree farm coming over there. And a bunch more stuff because we've still got like half this book to finish off. So uh, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy the video, be sure to like. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.